we get a break. Yeah. You know, we had some rain yesterday. We're going to have some rain later this week. Right now we're in the lull. So any type of errands you need to run, like go to the grocery store. Today's the day or tomorrow. Wouldn't quite get the car wash though, because we are looking at a free car wash headed our way Thursday and Friday. Weather set up right now, the cold front off to the southeast. That area of low pressure locked to the northwest. It needs that push, and that's not going to happen until Thursday and a Friday. That's whenever it will be tracking over us. Let's talk hour by hour, just tracking cloud cover throughout this morning and going into the afternoon. Notice it's mostly off to the east. That's where we saw more of the rain yesterday. That's also where it was also warmer yesterday, and some of those severe thunderstorms popped up that direction. But we're looking at mostly sunny skies west of that area, dealing with mostly sunny skies across the majority of the state. Some some of the high level clouds moving in as the cloud cover to the southeast starts to diminish later afternoon going into the evening. We'll still be looking at that cloud cover building in overnight tonight, and then we see some patchy fog possible by tomorrow morning. It's going to be very isolated, not a great chance, but still going to keep an eye out that as we go throughout Wednesday morning. Clouds move in late morning and going into the afternoon on Wednesday, staying dry. We're not going to have any rain chances just yet. But notice, focus the attention to the northwest, well, the <laughs> top left of your screen from the northwest. We'll be looking at that cold front headed our way. That's going to bring that chance for precipitation going into Thursday, Thursday night specifically, and going into Friday morning. So as far as what we're expecting for precipitation, it's going to be a decent drink of water. We need rain events like this to get us out of the drought, or at least get us closer to getting out of the drought. Because a lot of us central in the pretty much the southern half of the state looking at a good chance around half to a full inch of of rain even more uh, for the southeastern portion of the state further north into the northwest. Unfortunately, not looking at a great chance for those rainfall accumulations to add up to that much. Looks like closer to around a quarter is a, uh, or less in that direction. Becoming mostly sunny for today, calmer winds, and we're going to enjoy that as we go into Wednesday as well. The cloud cover and the rain chances return Thursday into Friday, and then for your weekend plans, we dry out. We're going to be a little on the cooler side relative to what we've seen over the past couple of weeks, but then we have highs back in the 60s to start next week.